So she does know she's going on a blind date, guys. But what she doesn't know is I'm setting her on a blind date with a girl, y'all. I've never done a blind date before. All yeah. right, I wanna see my man. Let's okay. go. <laughs> Are you kidding? Is that his sister? I mean, no, that's your dick. Come, Natalie. Okay, I just butchered the renegade challenge and I just need y'all to help me, please, y'all. Like, I feel like I'm late. Can y'all please help me with this challenge? Like, I'm getting old and my neck and my back is hurting when I start throwing them bowls at y'all. You feel me? But look, if you guys are new to our channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you want a shout out. All you gotta do is watch this video all the way through, comment hashtag post notification game, and subscribe, y'all. That's what you gotta do. We gonna shout you guys out every video. That's how we doing, you know, needs a game. But anyway, okay, so today's video, I don't really know how to feel because I don't know if I should feel saucy or happy relieved or stressed because I'm setting my best friend on a blind date y'all like yeah like so I don't I don't really know how to feel about that because like you know Natalie's been pretty lonely you know she don't get none of that intimate affection because she's always you know with me and we always working y'all so today I was like yo let me set my best friend up on a blind date you know what I'm saying get her juices flowing <laughs> okay that's too much so she does know she's going on a blind date guys but what she doesn't know is I'm setting her on a blind date with a girl y'all we're gonna test the waters out Natalie you don't know if you don't try it. you can't knock it till you try it best friend so that's what we're gonna do so without further ado oh before I go before I go hold on let me do that post notification shout out like I promise like I promise okay all right so today's post notification shout out goes to Ava Alton Woo! 35 minutes of my favorite people y'all feeding us well today if I could have it to be my way I would want y'all to post a long video every single day hashtag post notification gang yo Shout out to you, Ava, for watching our 30 minute video. One of our last videos was 30 minutes, and I appreciate you for watching each and every minute. So, look, guys, if you want to shout out, all you got to do is subscribe and turn your post notifications on and comment hashtag post notification game. Best friend! Hey! What you doing, girl? <laughs> Touches on my makeup. Yes, I missed you, girl. I missed you. I was just outside for a little bit. <laughs> I know. What are you doing? <laughs> Talking to the Neezy gang, 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 gang. You know what I'm saying? Tell them about, you know, your date. <laughs> oh, guys, I'm nervous. Ah, are you excited? I've never done a blind date before. Like, I really don't know what to expect. And she <laughs> set it up. So, I mean, I'm thinking my best friend knows me. So. I know you, girl. I know you know you. You know what I'm saying? But look, before we actually go on to the date, you get to choose your lucky contestant. What do you mean choose? What? You get to choose. I have a list and I didn't want to just give you somebody specifically. I wanted you to actually have a chance. You know, hear, hear who they are. You know what I'm saying? Do I get to see them? No. This is called a blind date, girl. What's the point of a blind uh, date if you get to see them? Okay, let's do it. I'm excited. Okay, come on. Let's get into it. Let's go. Right. Let's go. Let's go. You look good though. You look blessed. All right, Natalie, are you ready for your blind date contestant? I'm ready for the love of my life. Okay, that's a little bit too far. It's just a date. Okay. Just being optimistic. Okay, come on. <laughs> All right, okay, okay. So, contestant number one. This person is very attractive. Um, they have abs of steel. Oh. Yes. A low short cut fade. Okay, mm -hmm. little boozy face. <laughs> and they're also a professional trainer. Oh, okay. So he's definitely in shape then. I love that. Yes. Then I can I can fire my trainer and get one for free. Oh, okay. kill two birds with one stone. Okay, okay. Lastly, this person is a professional dancer. Oh. You're gonna bust a titty out in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think? You like you like contestant number one so far? I'm like, I like him. I like him. Okay. I'm feeling it. Okay, okay. Alright, here we go. Moving on to contestant number two. So, contestant number two. This person has long hair and stays with fresh braids. Okay, mm -hmm. I like that. We can play in each other's hair. All of that, all of that, girl. <laughs> Family oriented. Loves Aww, family. I, you know, you know that's you know, important to me. That's very that's important. important. Very important. And their fashion, incredible. Mm -hmm. 
dress is really, really good. Okay, that's, that's good. important because I want to be able to take him places and show out together. Yes. You already know because I like to dress up. Oh, really? Okay, and lastly, this person is a rapper. Uh-uh, I'm not about to be handing out mixtapes with him. Wait, wait, hold Scratch on. him out. Natalie, calm down. First and foremost, this person is a professional rapper. Oh has songs on the radio that you have actually heard. Also has a song with Chris Brown uh, and has been on national television starring in a major TV show. Okay. <laughs> what? Okay. I've always said I would never date a rapper, but you know what? The heart wants what it wants. <laughs> Okay, all right, cool, cool, cool. So you, you feeling contestant number two? I'm feeling him. I'm really okay. feeling him. Okay, but you said it, he has a song with Chris Brown, so it's not Chris Brown. <sighs> I'm trying to get my juices flowing, trying to figure out who this is. Let me hear number three. <laughs> all right, contestant number three, here we go. All right, so contestant number three has a bachelor degree in business administration. Okay, I, that's what I like to hear. Yeah. Someone intelligent, mm -hmm. okay. Also very family oriented as well, loves family. Yes, love, love. The way to my heart. Yes. Also does not have any kids. Okay, I, perfect, because I want to start a family with someone. I don't want, you know, going into it with separate families and baby mama drama. And, <sighs> my head's spinning just thinking about it. Perfect. <laughs> okay, and lastly, this person was a professional basketball player. Oh, so a professional basketball player? Okay, so he's tall. I know that. He has to be at least, what, like six, it's over six foot. Okay. Oh, you know I like tall guys. Oh my God, I'm excited. Ooh. All right, and for the last contestant. <laughs> the hey, I got four contestants? Four, girl. Oh my God, they're just knocking down my door. <laughs> okay, so for the fourth contestant, this person also has long hair. Oh, okay. I feel like I'm going on a date with Jason Momoa. Okay. Oh. Please tell me it's Jason Momoa. Definitely not Jason Momoa. Okay. Well, why do they all have long hair then? Uh, well, because they're very attractive. It's 2020, everybody got long hair nowadays. And on top of it, you know, you can use your hair product that you make in both of your hair. Whoa, 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 slow down. That's for marriage, okay? Oh, oh, it's big time. Oh okay. yeah, I'm not sharing my hair products with just anyone. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, also, this person is very loving, very sweet, and also well known in their community. Aww, okay, so probably giving back charitable stuff in the community. That's what I like to hear. Yeah. And this person also cares about health and wealth. They run three miles every single day before uh, starting their day. Uh, I love someone with some stamina, if you know what I mean. No, we don't know what you mean. Natalie, calm down. Damn. This might not be the best top to wear on this date. <laughs> They're going to think I'm a little forward. <laughs> and lastly, about contestant number four, this person not only does music, but has a very successful clothing line. Oh. Yeah. And, and I even bought some of their clothes. <laughs> yes. God, where did you all of these people i think i want to date them all can you just tell them all to come well, i'm gonna have them this battle it out it's gonna be like for the love of natalie oh my god <laughs> natalie you only could choose one i know i got i got the homies you know and i got the connections but i made sure that i chose the best of the best so which contestant are you gonna go with okay really um, think about it who are you gonna choose who are you gonna choose really think about it contestant number one two three four huh okay i don't know so Guys, help me choose below. Who would you pick? Okay. Um, okay. So I think like I really liked contestant number two. Okay, okay. That was the rapper. The rapper. Okay. But honestly, I don't know. The, what? I always said I would never date a rapper because I just it just sounds a little playerish to me. So yeah. I'm gonna have to cut contestant number two. Okay, alright. So you got three contestants left. Okay. Okay. Alright. Alright. Alright, so Mm, okay, contestant number one sounds fine with that boosie fade, Ooh. but I'm gonna have to say no. What? Only number one? Because, okay, listen, listen, let me. And the abs of steel. I know. 
a professional I'm trainer? What? Okay. The only reason I'm saying no to contestant number one is because you also said that he's a professional dancer. And you know when you just say professional dancer, that can mean anything. Oh I'm God. thinking maybe exotic dancer, and I'm too jealous for that. I only want him dancing on me. So, okay. Okay. yeah, I don't know. I feel like that would just cause rifts in our relationship, you know? So I'm going to have to cancel out contestant number one. Sorry. Wow. Okay. All right. Okay, so you got two more people left. All right. Who are you going to choose? Oh my god, alright, how do I choose? Alright, between three and four, let me okay. think. Okay, contestant number three is obviously tall. Ooh, and I like some height. But contestant number four is very well known in his community, but that could be a good or a bad thing because somebody too popular, I don't know, sometimes they be having drama, oh you know? Okay. So, alright, let me think. Um, Really, really take your time. Okay, think. I am, I am. All right, but then also contestant number four has his own clothing line, and you know I love to dress, so maybe some of the stuff is unisex. <laughs> um, all right, come on. All right, hurry up, hurry up, hey, I'm, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, excited. I'm thinking. Gotta... All right, contestant number three has a business degree, and Ooh. that just sounds super sexy to me. I can learn a thing or two, all right? Yeah. I got businesses of my own. And you said no kids. Ah, uh, I think... Honestly, the no kids part is standing out to me so much because I really don't want somebody with kids going into it. Okay. And you didn't say that for anyone else. So I'm thinking, does that mean everyone else has kids? I don't know, but- Come on, choose! Oh, okay! Damn. I'm gonna choose contestant number three! Oh, contestant number three! The number three, the basketball player. Okay, okay, I'm shocked, okay, well damn. This was hard, y'all. Okay. Who did you say you would choose? Comment below. Okay, comment below. All right, so without being said, I guess she chose contestant number three. I'm sorry, y'all. I wanted all of you guys to win, but hey, she only get to choose one. Okay, so with that being said, contestant number three has a very special date set up for you. Are you excited? Are you ready? Ah! So romantic. I'm excited. Romantic. Yes, I'm gonna be, you know, having the camera behind the scenes. Don't even look at me, okay? I'm gonna be there, you know? You can be there. I gotta catch it. I gotta get the date on camera. Okay. And also, lucky contestant number three has a beautiful message for you. Okay. Let's hear it. Well, you can read it. Here's the message down below. Aww. Oh my God. That is so romantic. Okay, I'm dressed for the occasion then because I was a little worried that I should be a little more dressed up, but it is just like lunch, so. I mean, you cute or whatever. <laughs> You know what? Get you a more supportive best friend. Yo, supportive. I set this whole thing up, girl. All Yo. right, I want to see my man. Let's okay. go. Okay, Nat, we're here. We're here, Nat. Nat, you ready? Are you ready? Um, I'm nervous. Why? At the park. I mean, I guess he wasn't playing when he said, you know, dress down. I mean, I'm I'm dressed for vacation, I guess. Okay, I mean, it's it's gonna be cool. Come on, let's go. Let's go see what what your contestant looks like and uh, I guess I'll introduce you. Come on, let's get it. You gonna be there the whole time? Yeah, I'm the ca don't even I'm not even really here. I'm just the camera, okay? This is awkward. No, it's not. Okay, hey, I'm nervous. Do I look good? You look good. You is look my good. lipstick like on my not teeth really, or anything? You look I'm not here. I'm not supposed to be here. Okay, is this too much? Right? No, it's not too much. Come on. Oh, someone's doing a picnic. That's cute. Not wait, Natalie, not just someone. You are doing a picnic. What do you mean I'm doing a picnic? You're doing a picnic. What do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> Are you kidding? Is that his sister? I mean, no, that's your dick. Natalie, don't be rude. Don't oh be rude. Oh my God. Oh, that's sweet. How you doing? Hey. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So, yeah, <laughs> you guys are going on a date. This is Krista. Uh, you know, this is Natalie. Yes. Hi. I wanted to set her up on a blind date. You know, she had no idea, oh you know, God. what was going on. And aren't you excited? <laughs> what, why are you awkward? <laughs> what do you mean? I mean, I was picturing someone else, you know, like a boy. What? Well, I mean, you know, well, not that. She, she's not that. You know? Okay, but you, what about everything you said about her, you know? I mean, yeah. your resume was, you know, impressive. Oh, why, thank you. Yeah, you know, I was just picturing, like, tall, dark, and handsome, like, oh. basketball player. I'm thinking, like, you oh. know, like, okay. We go up twice. Sit down. Take a seat. Take a seat. You know, don't judge me yet just because of my height. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. All right. All right. So, I have some other flowers here for you too. Oh, thanks. 
I love pink flowers. <laughs> <laughs> they're real. Oh. If you think they're real. Okay. Thank you for coming on this date with me. Yeah, no problem. Yeah. I've yeah. always wanted to meet you. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. So, I mean, what do you like to do? Um, I like to watch movies, uh, hang out, chill, eat. Healthy foods mostly, because mm -hmm. you know I'm an athlete and stuff. Okay. Play basketball. Oh, you know, yeah, I just do stuff like this. Oh, okay. let me get up and really show you, you know. Oh, you know, cool. since I'm not dark skinned, tall, and handsome. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? I do stuff like this, you know, I break it down like that. You know what I'm saying? You know, I, I mean, I dribble the basketball. It don't matter if you're on grass oh. or not. You know, you're going why don't you in. Why don't you come, why don't you come and go grab me? I really should right go. now. Yeah, it's kind of like a, you know, like a sentimental moment we'll have together you, that you'll never forget. Okay. I thought we were gonna kind of fall. Let's just save those ankles. Come on. I thought we were gonna eat maybe a little bit, but. No, no, no. So I'll be like this, right? I'll be like this. Okay. You know, I'm not tall. Yeah. Okay, come on. Okay. Try to take the basketball. Oh, oh. My, all right. This is not feeling like loving basketball. All right. I mean, if you can't handle me, you definitely can't handle a tall, dark skinned guy. <laughs> I mean, I was <laughs> planning to play basketball with you. Oh, my... You're right, you're right, you're right. right. Okay, you're hungry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's the competitive nature in me, you know what I'm saying? I'm just gonna sit next to you. Is that okay? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Sorry about so, that. That's okay. Enough of the rough housing. Right, right. Um, why don't you show me what you yeah, brought? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I brought a lot of stuff. Uh, I have some grapes here. Oh, nice. Uh, I got some juices if you get thirsty. You might get thirsty after that. You um, brought us box drinks? Well, I figured you wouldn't want to get messy. You know what I'm saying? So it's like safe. You can set it down, not worry about the spills. That sounds you like <laughs> you think I'm a child. Uh, no, no, I'm not thinking about that. I mean, this isn't in a in juice box. You know what I'm saying? You brought the drone. No, I mean, just loosen you up a little bit. You seem kind of stiff, anyways. You know what I'm saying? Like you got dust. <laughs> All right. Usually people bring wine on a picnic, but you're going straight for the kill. I see Patron. You like Patron, right? Hey, Michelle. I got money too. Patron's kind of expensive. Okay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Apples, healthy. Okay. Yeah. And these are actually the best ones. Pink ladies. Oh, oh my god, they're so sweet. Oh, so you know your apples. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Got some cheese and some crackers. You know what I mean? Wash it down. I guess you don't like box juices again. <laughs> Patron! <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Woo! Turn up! <laughs> well, let's get some grace. You, you know, know I feel saying? like we would probably be great friends. You know? Well, good thing we have this date so that we don't have to become friends. Hopefully things go well. Ah, okay. Right? Yeah. <laughs> you, gotta, right. Yeah, you gotta be open-minded. Yeah, you know you're right. I'm yeah. super open-minded. You want some grapes? Sure. Kobe! What the heck? Are you serious? Yeah, come on. Kobe! Uh, you're, no, I feel like this is not cute. I'll just feed them to myself. Last one, last one, last one. Let's just see if I make it. Kobe, wait, let me get one more job. You're not one. making it. I will, this one. You're way. not, though. Let's <laughs> just try. I thought you played for the rest. Let's try. Okay. Open up, open up. That way, if you want to move. Uh, yeah, I know. I just feel like Look, you're going to make me choke on a grave. All right, here. You know what? <laughs> you want to try? Come on, I'll give you a try. I'm Come just going to eat an I'll apple. I'll give you three tries. No, I'm you just. Go ahead, you can do it to me. Come on, All three right. tries. Here we go. All right, let's try it. <laughs> never done this Look on a date. This is what makes it fun. You ain't never going to forget. Come on. Oh shit, that was, that was bad. That's okay, that's okay. Right. Oh, I was close, that was close. <laughs> I mean, I got closer than you did. Well, I'm also not moving. <laughs> ah. Oh, okay. Oh, we did it. All right. I think that's good time for throwing that one. <laughs> okay, I'm good on the patrol, but you can take the shot. Oh no, I think I ain't gonna do anything. Yeah, you really love your basketball, huh? Yeah, it's kind of like, if you're in a relationship with me, you're in a relationship with basketball, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I think it's like a love connection between, like, you know, for instance, maybe us three, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. us three. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, But, you know, enough about me. What do you like to do, you know? Uh, um, what do I like to do? I love traveling. Uh-huh. Yeah, um, and I love to watch movies, you know? Um, is this kind of like a theater right here? Yeah, I feel like you're not really paying attention. <laughs> you said you like to travel, like to watch movies that involve me in basketball. Okay, yeah. that's your favorite movie, Love and Basketball. What? <laughs> what you trying to do? Nothing. <laughs> no. Okay, have you ever been on a blind date? No, this is my um, first blind date. Okay, it's going pretty well. Yeah. <laughs> that didn't seem so, uh, you know. It's just, I don't know. Like, there's just some 
strange things happening, but. Why? Because I'm a girl. Well, that, and then, like, it, I didn't expect, you know, you were going to bring your basketball on the day. Well, I wanted to really impress you. Oh, that's cute. That was cute. Okay, that was a good save. So, I keep on, like, mentioning me being a girl. Like, what are your, like, concerns? Like, what are you scared of? I'm not really scared of anything, really. It's just that I've never, like, I've never really been interested in girls. So, you know, like, and that's if it's just like, oh, we look like we could be good friends. Like, she looks fun, you know what I mean? But so, so that's like you're, you know, you have a boyfriend. Usually you're with them because you have a good time with them, right? So it's the same thing just because I'm a girl, you know? I just don't even know how that works, though. Like, I mean, I, my best friend's a lesbian. Did you throw up quotation marks? When? You said lesbian? Did I? Because the way that you said it was like lesbian, like. Oh, no, like, she's definitely, mean? she's a hardcore lesbian. No. <laughs> I'm still right here, guys. <laughs> okay, well, defend yourself, best friend. <laughs> but anyway, back to the show. All right, cool. So, yeah, so, but I've never seen her in a relationship. So, like, who right. would, like, I don't know, this might sound stupid, but I just can't picture it, like, who, like, plays what role like the guy the girl like you know what i'm saying well we're both girls all right so there's not really like a role but you know what i mean when that time of the monk comes you know bloody mary comes you know <laughs> uh, i'd be acting i could be having my mood swing so i'm gonna need you to like you know take care of me sometimes open up the door sometimes you know oh. if i have you know some cravings go give me some ice cream <laughs> you know but you know but i'll do that i'll deal with that with you too oh okay you know what I mean? Well, so not, it, works, it works both ways. Okay. You know? That's interesting. Yeah. Alright, so who would pay at dinner? Oh, we're splitting that. We both girls! What do you mean? <laughs> ah, so we would have to split everything all the time? Yeah, like I'm definitely sending you, you, you won't cash at me later. For what this? Is. Yeah! This is a mutual like agreement. We came on a fun day together. Oh my god! <laughs> I mean, it wasn't that expensive. I went to a 99 cent store. I got like, I got this, you know, apple juice and, you know, these ain't really real, just in case. No, I, I know. I'm, I noticed oh. earlier. Oh, I, yeah, 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 yeah. So if it ain't, it'll be that expensive, but cash out for me, for sure. I'll give it to you. I mean, I'll give it to Easy. Yeah, Easy, you don't have to cover this. You're I am not here, this, so yeah, it's on y'all. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah. So like, okay, I have a question, I have a question. Have you ever kissed a girl? <laughs> no. I mean, no, I, I just haven't, no. Why, because the opportunity never presented itself? I mean, I'm sure it has presented itself, I just never have. You ever thought about it? No, you don't have to answer that question, because today is your lucky day. Oh, Come here, girl. wait, hold on. First of all, you're moving too fast. Second of all, is that a, what's that ring? Um, I'm married. What? You're married? Yeah. Um, best friend, mm -hmm. only did you set me up on a blind date with a woman, a married woman? Oh, uh, I didn't, I, for, I forgot, I left that part out. I said she didn't have no kids. But, and she I gave mean, me the hall pass. Yeah. Well, it's important for her to be single. Na come on, Nat. Well, I mean, it's 2020. It's 2020, you know 2020 Nat. Come on. It's you know what I'm saying? Oh, hell what? no. What? Oh, no. What? Best friend, I'm about to beat your ass. Oh, bad. wait. No, don't leave. Best friend. Come on. Come on. Crystal. What are you going? Hey, hey, wait, 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 w
She's not like this, guys. She was in on it the whole time, yeah. y'all. Oh my yes, God. yes. I literally told her about this. The worst date with the girl that you possibly could. Yeah. I'm hoping so. I'm really hoping nobody's worse than that. <laughs> and if you are, you're gonna be single for the rest of your life. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Yo, I was like, if, if this is what dating a girl's cracked up to be, I'm just <laughs> good for real. Yeah. Yeah. Good for real. <laughs> All right, Nat, Nat, we'll close it out. Let me see the let me see the ball tricks you got. Close oh, it out, Nat, Nat, close it out. All Tell right, y'all. Uh, if you are new to this channel, make sure you guys subscribe, turn those post notifications on, and comment hashtag Neezy Gang below. Yeah, yeah. Make, make sure, sure you follow Krista too. Yeah, follow her, subscribe right, to her come channel. Over here, come over here, Natalie. Oh, uh oh, what you about to do? This, might, about this to might really change her mind. Okay. Okay, wait a minute. Hold uh, she on. might now be on the other side after this one. Hold it still. Don't let your finger drop. Wait. Come on, baby ah! girl. Come on, baby girl. Come on.